all right, so let's fulfill fences, fulfill gates. He needs two doors. He needs 47 gravel. Um, he needs the stairs, which is weird. I thought we fulfilled I that. Know. Let's look in his inventory. Maybe we just put it directly in his inventory. I'll take care of it. Let's fulfill that. He needs a shovel again. He must have broke his shovel, so we'll need to make him a a shovel. Um, another shovel. I thought the stone shovel would have worked for him, but I guess not. I'm going to try that one more time, though. Let's try and make him a stone shovel. Let's see what happens real quick. Well, we have a stone shovel. Let's see if we can fulfill that. I'll take care of it. No, for some reason he just does not. It's either wood or gold. That's all he wants. It seems like. I hope. Weird. All right, we'll make him another wood shovel. Doop doop. And doop. In fact, let's make him three, just so he has what he needs. We'll keep three on him. So if he breaks one, he's got what he needs there. All right, dude. I hope. Take that. I'll take care of it. And then we'll go ahead and toss these in there for you. So you have three of them. Weird, he's just consuming them. I wonder if he's storing them in here. He is. Look at that. So you can put stuff in here, and he'll store it. That's cool. And so we can get rid of all this crap he doesn't need. Right? Put this over here in our box for now. We'll have to make a throwaway something. I hope. So I think he's like busy crafting things and using things, and then he puts them away, which is weird. We need to find him gravel. So let's go find 47 gravel somewhere. I'm going to go find a gravel pit. I'll be right back. So I remembered when we were on our trip here how we stopped here for the night last time and there's this is a huge amount of gravel so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually just come in here and, and loot all the gravel that I can and I think we'll use we'll try and use this trick that used to work I don't know if it still works but that's where you go and throw a torch underneath and it breaks that whole that whole row for you you just gotta you gotta time it right like that see and so you just basically run through the gravel works with sand pretty much works with anything with gravity you just break it and right click in and you get your you get your gravel and so I'm gonna run through here real quick and I'm just gonna get a bunch of gravel I'm gonna take back as much as I can hold in here and uh, we'll head home afterwards all right a new day on the colony so let's see what does this dude need still Where you at, dude? Are you actually doing anything, or are you... I gonna say, didn't look like you were. Alright, um... I'll take care of you. What do you need still? He needs some spruce logs, some more stairs, some more slabs. He needs four slabs, and he needs 47 gravel. Let's fulfill that. Let's get him his stairs. I think he forgot he put his stairs away. Or did he not? No, they're not in here. So he needs more stairs than that? Really? What do you need? 168 stairs, nine slab, or four slabs, and nine logs. Let's see what he needs still. I'll take care of it. There, there, and let's make him some slabs real quick. He needs four slabs. I hope. All right, everything's been fulfilled. He has all his requests that he needs. Let's see how long it takes him to finish this now. He still has a wooden shovel. He's got all the stairs, he's got all the slabs, all the logs. He should have everything he needs. So now we wait for him to finish the work, basically. So my other citizens are over here with this weird effect going on them, and I don't know what's well, happening with enough, that. Eh? Um. But, let's do this real quick, because if you look in here and you go to this one, you can see the happiness levels on everything. 
There's no guards in the colony. The social factor, unemployment's a problem. Homelessness is a problem. Hunger is a problem. So we can deal with hunger, I think, if we... Is there an inventory on this somewhere? Maybe not. Maybe we got to deal with them individual. So if we do... I'll take care of let's you. give each of them five food at least. Inventory. You can have fruit salads. I serve with Inventory. Pleasure. And you can have five. Alright, and now they'll eat. And it looks like that gets rid of the... The weird effect. They were starving. I wonder if we can... Not good enough, hmm. eh? So I think the next thing we're going to build is... I'm not even sure. Probably the, that, honestly. Town Hall. Decided to help him along here. This first time anyways. So it'll probably be quicker later on once we have um, better tools. But if I help him clear this area, then it won't be so bad, right? And he can... He can do his building thing. So as I help him with it, I'm just using a stone shovel because stone's cheap and I can use my crude repair kit to do that. I'm curious what's going to happen when we get all the dirt out of how he's going to deal with those those blocks there. But we're going to find out, so let's just keep it going. And we'll be back. Well, he's finally got to a place where he's building at least. So that's good. Though that looks like that collides into that. Did I build this wrong? Oh no, I built this wrong. I'm just looking at this and I totally built this wrong. Um, let's cancel the build. We need to move it because that's colliding with the town hall, which we don't want to do. So let's move all of this. Let me do this again. We'll get this moved over. I'm just going to pick all this up and get it out of his way real quick. you got to be very careful about that because you don't want two builds colliding into each other. So let's put this in here. The spruce. That was oak. Let's put this spruce into there. Let's get our build tool out, which I think is over here in the... Sounds like we've got a cave system under us. You can hear all kinds of nasty stuff there. All right, take you. And we're going to right click on this guy. Build options. Repair, build building. Nope. I want this removed. Let's pick this up. I think we got to pick it up completely, is what we got to do. And all of my stuff exploded all over the place. He just became a normal dude. Um, let me dump everything back into here real quick. Quick, quick, quick. Get the rest of that picked back up. Okay, and we're going to try this again. Do I have the builder's hut? I do. Alright, now how do we do this? Okay, so we want... A builder hut and we want it to be Nordic Nordic there we go and we need to get out of where it's gonna be I'm gonna go over here I think when we changed it to Nordic we changed the way it's gonna look so if we go this way with it and bring it back this way Like there. It's your gold. And then bring it down to there. It's your gold. And then let's take a look, make sure nothing else is colliding with it that we care about. It's out of the way of that, it leaves us a good roadway. Alright, we're gonna do go on that. Alright. And then we're going to Go up here and sleep real fast, and then we'll sign the rest in the morning.
All right, he's running for night, so let's sleep real quick. Make sure no monsters spawn around here. Boom. And then he comes back to work. He's almost done, it looks like. He does want something, though. What do you want, buddy? It's your gold. He still wants 96 spruce stairs. All right, so let's make some more spruce stairs. We'll it's give him what he needs. Gold. There's 40. Hi-ho. Sixty-four, um, not quite enough, almost enough, but not quite. All right, that should be plenty. Plenty. It's your gold. Fulfilled. Let's go talk to these others. They have, they have needs. I serve with pleasure. Nope. I serve with pleasure. Really like a house to live in. All right, so we need to do a that. Let's finish this though. We'll let this guy finish. You missing something, dude? I ho. Really like a house to live in. Okay, well we'll build that next. We'll build some houses next. You finish this, and we'll build some houses. Hey, Mel. Boom. Done. He did it. He built a house. Finish building building one. Reach the goal of build the builder building. Uh, ba -ba 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 what's it say? All land within one chunk of the building has been claimed. With the builder site complete, we should turn our attention to resource production. Perhaps you could get a forest or a miner or a tavern to your house to house your citizens. Okay, so that's good. Um, does he still need a home? Escape out of that. I'll take care of it. Like a house to build in. Skip the I'll chit chat. Nothing requests. So that's how we get the Builder's Hut. So I think the next thing we need to do is get these guys a house. Or maybe have them all work on this town hall, which this might have been the first thing we should have built. Um, so we'll have to look into this and see what we need to do for the town hall. I think this time what we're going to do is we're going to collect all of this and put it in the inventory first. And then we will activate the build. So let me get that done and then I'll, I'll be back. All right, so we have everything we need right here for this build. I've been piling it up in here as I get it. So what we need to do then is we need to come here to the build options and we need to say build building. So the build request is made and then we can take all of this. I emptied out my inventory as you can see. We can sleep off the night real fast. Let me grab my sleeping bag. Sleeping bag, where are you? There you are. Pop that down real fast. Get rid of the zombies. Go away. Boop. All zombies gone. All right, and then what we do is we come over here. We open this guy's up. And we say, who is building this? Who is building this? I get to build it again? Rename, hmm. Information. Started building town hall. So he's going to start building town hall here. And we can put that in his inventory. Where'd he go? All right, so we'll dump into his inventory. Unless we put it... Do you normally put it in the other I thing? With pleasure. I don't know. But we will I give know. him... Skip the chit-chat request. Fulfill, 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 fulfill. So that's everything he needs. 
And now he should be able to start building. And now we just wait. And we'll have a town hall before too long. Alright, so a couple days have passed. And he finished building the town hall here. Um, just had to keep him in tools and let him work. And he got it all done. Um, you see they're all hiding out in here. This guy's been complaining about food, but I can't activate him. Now I can activate him. There we go. Of course, because I went to show you guys, it wouldn't let me do it. Um, I don't think I'll eat strawberries, though. So we need to get him some food. But really... Oh, there he goes. Okay, good. So really, they all want a house, right? I've been waiting for over two weeks to get a job. I'm very upset. This guy says, I haven't had a house for two weeks. I'm really upset. This guy says, waiting for over two weeks to get a job. So we need to give him a job. And I'm not sure exactly what that job's going to be. I think we need to build things to give them a job. So I've been laying out um, plots here. You'll see there's three plots for houses. Because that's another thing they've all been complaining about is not having a house. So there's a house, there's a house, there's a house. Uh, we'll build those eventually. We probably need a, a job for them. But if you look at the map, by the way, I used the shovel and made path in the dirt. And you can see what the full outline of this colony is going to be. So we're going to build some things like out on platforms here too. So they're going to have a little bit of everything in this colony. And you can see where these two are going to be. This guy's going to be here. You can kind of get the, the feel of what it's going to be. I also went ahead and made um, a garden over here. Because I figured the easiest thing to feed them right now would be just bread. So I can just come over here and grab all the wheat and make bread and feed them that way to keep them in food but I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna go next before we build what was that a bone when did must have been the skeleton in here overnight um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna probably uh, if I was looking at the mine colonies buildings and you can kind of kind of flip through here and you can see all the different buildings but there's a farm and then there's also a fisher's hut and I was thinking one of them was a fisherman might be nice to get them food. So we'll try to go with that next, I think. There's a forester's hut for cutting trees. Uh, I don't think that's as important. So let's um, let's go back. We're going to make the fishing pole. And we'll make a fishing hut from there. And then we'll put that down. And maybe that'll give one of them a job fishing for the group. Hopefully that'll give them... I don't know if it's for us or for them, but we're going to find out. Uh, so let me get that created real quick and I'll be right back. So one of the things I'm growing is knaf in the garden and we can use that to make string. So that's over here. I think we've got hemp too. So there's a couple ways of doing it, it looks like. But if we do like that, it looks like we can get three string. And then we can make a sufficient pole. Like that. I noticed I had to come back to the house. I'm thinking about moving my house over there. Uh, and I might use that as an excuse to do, um, to teach that builder how to build the recipe for my house, and we'll see if he'll build it. I don't know if that's a thing. I think that's a thing you can do in this, uh, but we'll see. Um, fisher hut, this guy, bonk. All right, we got a fisher hut, so we're gonna take that back over there. I'm gonna make some food real quick, and then I'll I'll catch you guys back over there. So one other thing I'm gonna make before I go back are like four of these racks, these mine colony racks. I think we already did that, but that's two nuggets and some planks. I think the builder can access items within these as if they're additional storage in his building hut. So I'm going to remove the um, the chests that I have in there, at least some of them. I'm going to keep one for personal stuff like that I don't want him messing with. And I'm going to put a bunch of these in there, and then we can load those with materials, and we'll see if he can access from there. I'm kind of curious if he can or not. We'll experiment with this, but uh, let me get these made, and I'll catch you guys over there all right we're gonna use the build tool we're gonna choose the fisherman and I want to step out of the area here so I can see um, first of course let's sleep off this night that's coming because we don't want our villagers to be savaged by the undead Boom. all right and now what we're gonna do is we're gonna choose this hut and how this hut works and where it goes and I don't think we're gonna necessarily do all things Nordic I know we're definitely not because oof this is a big old cavern right here because um, 
I already did those three different things with different shapes. Look how much space this fisherman hut takes up. That's crazy. Um, but I guess we'll do it here. We'll get this back out. If we rotate it... Let me see. That is a lot of space, isn't it? Um, I feel like he's gonna want... Let's choose a different style first. Let's go with a stone fisherman's hut. We're just gonna make him a stone fisherman's hut. And if we bring it this way... Like that... Yeah, this will be a real simple one that we'll build. Uh, I think we want it like that. Yeah. And we'll do it right there, and we'll see what he does with the water. I'm curious what he does with water underneath. So if we say okay on this, and we put the fisherman's hut here, what we can do then is we can come over and we can say, okay, what do we need for this? So if we look here, and we look at... Um, build options we can see all the stuff that we need so i'm gonna go ahead and collect a bunch of this i'm gonna go in i'm gonna put racks down i'm gonna leave one for this because obviously he wants a rack in this build i'm gonna get all this stuff put it in to the the builder hut make sure he has enough and i'm gonna sort things onto racks and out of chests i'll bring you guys back when i'm done that before we start this and we'll see what happens Okay, so we get this all set up over here. This rack came with the place when we built it. So I've got wood, different wood types in here. I changed this out for an oak tree here so we can start getting oak as well. So oak and spruce and sticks and all of that. I set up another double rack. It's like a double chest, but it's a double rack. This is stone or cobblestone, dirt, sandstone, which I found a place over here that we got sandstone from on these cliffs. They're like sand cliffs, and I, had, I saw sandstone sticking out there, so I went and got that. Um, gravel and andesite, found some extra. And I've placed, built things in, in this one, like stairs and sprue, you know, slabs, another rack, which is needed, some trap doors, which was needed. So everything exists here in these uh, racks that he needs to build this fishing hut. The only thing I left in his own inventory, because I wanted to see what would happen, is tools. And so I made him like a bronze paxel. I want to see if he'll prefer that over... That's actually my matic there. So he's got some iron tools, he's got some wood tools, he's got some stone tools. And he's got his food here, his PB&J. Um, I couldn't fulfill his request using the, the stone tools, but I did see he picked them up and used them. So there must just be something in that fulfill command that's a little funky. So I'm going to see if he'll use those things. So what we're going to do is we're going to come over here. we got everything we need on the racks in there. So I'm hoping he can, any racks he can look at. We're going to come here, we're going to go to build options, and we're going to say build building. And then it should assign a worker here in a second. We should see that happen. Um, manage workers. You must construct this hut before you can hire a worker. Oh, okay, so that's the workers for the thing itself, not who we're doing. So we need the builder, actually. There he is. Lawrence Conquest started building Fisherman 1. And so he should start coming over here. I want to see what happens. He's going to come over here, and he's going to start cleaning it off. Um, and he probably already had, if we look in his inventory, he's got some bread and some other stuff like that in here. I'm not sure how he got the bread, unless they're doing the garden now too. I don't think so though. Maybe I gave them bread earlier. So let's see what he does here. I'm curious if he's going to start checking the racks for things. So he's definitely coming over to the tool thing. Wait and see what happens. Maybe when I'm in here, he, let's see what happens if we just leave him for a second. What are you going to do, my friend? What are you going to do? Okay, so it's been a little while and he has done nothing. So I'm going to try something else. This rack here came with his hut. So let's see if we can put this stuff that he requested. Um, all these things he needed. On this hut real quick. Or on this guy. We're going to load all this stuff onto this rack. Looks like it's taking it out. Aha! So I guess it, it doesn't see these. It must not see these guys at all. It must only see this guy. So this would be the, the working 
rack then that you'd want to throw stuff into that he needs for his build. As you see, he's he's now putting stuff back into this rack. So, let's see what else he's doing. If we look at the inventory here, he's just done nothing with this. But it looks like he's going back and forth and sorting things out in his head. Let's see if there's anything else I'm missing. I don't think so. So now he's off. Yeah, so this rack here, this is the rack that you want to put your stuff on. And then you can do other racks if you want, but they're just for decoration because it looks like he only works off of that rack, that double rack. But as we can see, he's now building with sandstone. He's building out the platform that they want. And that way, you know, it looks like a beach, but it's kind of, it doesn't have the gravity effect. So that's pretty cool. Alright, so we'll give him a little while, see if he'll build this, and then uh, we'll come back and see what's up. So pretty much as soon as he finished this house, Ursula came running over here. I guess she's going to be the fisherman. And she asked for fishing poles. So I ran to the house and made her three fishing poles and put them in the little thing here. And you can see she's fishing away now. Build it again? And we can see in her inventory she's getting a bunch of fish. So I don't know how, how she'll feed the others, but I guess we'll wait and see what happens. I don't know how that's going to work. Um... I'll have to look that up probably. I think the next thing we're going to do though is I'm going to collect all the materials for these these different blocks. And I want to make sure I've got enough room between them. One, two, three, four. Mostly because I've read that you want you want like four or five blocks between each uh, build so that you have upgrade room. So like this tape would have come to here. So we probably actually want to take these down and, and move them out. I want to spread them out a little more than this. So I'm glad I had read that before. But that's probably what I'll do is I'll get going with that. Um, and then um, then I will start collecting the materials for the, each of these and get these houses built so everybody has a home. Yeah. 